Welcome to Datable Thesis. Today we will be talking on breathing networking. A bridge is a repeater with add on the types of bridges. There are mainly three types in which bridges can be characterized. Transparent bridge, as the name signifies. It appears to be transparent for the other devices on the network. The other devices are ignorant of its existence. It only blocks or forwards the data after the mark address. Secondly, we have the source wood bridge. Derives its name from the fact In that the path the which packet takes through the network is implanted within the packet. It is mainly used in open ring networks. And lastly, the translational bridge. Process of conversion takes place via translational bridge. It converts the data format of one network into another. For instance, token rings to internet and vice versa. This is the diagram of a bridge. The following are the functions of bridge. 1. It minimizes unwanted traffic. 2. It minimizes network congestion. 3. It acts as a filter. 4. Error links can be identified and isolated. 5. Security features or access control can be added. 6. It maintains a table that marks addresses to the port. Advantages of a bridge. 1. Bridges can extend a network by acting as a repeater. Can reduce network traffic on a segment by subdividing network communication. 3. Bridges increase the available bandwidth to individual so nodes because fewer nodes share. So collision domain. 4. Bridges reduce collision. 5. Some bridges connect fall. networks using Don't different media types know. and architectures. Disadvantages of a bridge. 1. Because bridges do more than repeaters by viewing MAC addresses. The extra processing makes them slower than repeaters and hops. 2. Bridges forward broadcast frames indiscriminately, so they do not filter broadcast traffic. 3. Bridges are more expensive than repeaters and 